I don't know why anybody would be so kind-hearted, um, but I'm not too much in a position to turn it down either, so that's kind of the way it goes. Actually, uh, helping people in trouble is, is an old farm tradition. Somebody gets hurt, the neighbors come to help. But as farms get bigger and further between, that kind of help gets harder to do. So maybe, maybe you're here to fill in that gap, I'm not sure. They always ask me, how do you spell your last name? And I always say, Y-O-U-R-L-A-S-T-M-A-N-E. Had my 39th anniversary, my 39th birthday. Now anybody can add can figure that out. Well, you see corn stalks, that's probably where the soybeans are gonna be. This little bit of green weed coming here, that's called periwinkle. I don't know how it ever got that name of periwinkle. It used to be a, 70 years ago, it used to be a cartoon comic strip, Periwinkle. I don't know if it's related to that or not. See that there will go to soybeans too. I bought this farm. I also bought the farm that was my grandfather's homestead in Minnehaha County. And uh, so that means a lot to me down there. I moved to Brookings uh, to teach at South Dakota State a few years back, about 40, and uh, time goes by. Uh, and so I have lived here on this farm for 40 years. And uh, after I left the engineering and so on, I just mostly farm. And uh, I enjoy it. It's, uh, it's my, my favorite occupation. I have... Uh, uh, a couple of bad knees and a bad ankle and a bad shoulder and, and uh, my attitude's good though, <laughs> I think. Uh, and actually the thing that really put me down was uh, I fell last January and uh, broke my hip. And so uh, it's coming along but it's, it's a slow recovery on that. And uh, so that will probably be a plus if I don't overuse that for a while. Not at all adapted at emptying bags into a flannery dell anymore. So uh, that will uh, make my body last a little longer, I think. This gal, actually, she periodically unbends my eyeglasses if I sit on them or something like that, you know. And uh, she uh, has a optical place in town. Uh, so uh, I've, I've known her for a while, and, and the eye doctor that uh, gives exams there and so on. And uh, she knew that uh, I had gotten my hip hurt, and she knew, of course, that I was short an arm and, and a few other things. But So she took the liberty to call and ask about the, uh, the program that you have. And she got some literature back, and then she brought it out to show me. And, and uh, she insisted that I call about it, so I, I did. So. Tom and I chatted, and uh, Tom Olson, right? Um, he said he'd get back to me, and he did, and said he'd like to send the crew out for some help, and and uh, that's fine. I would really appreciate it. Thank you.